Welcome to our tech tutorial. Today, we're tackling a question that many new React Native developers encounter. Our viewer is eager to create an audio playing app using React Native and has chosen the React Native Sound Library. However, they're facing a challenge when it comes to playing audio files directly from an S3 URL. Let's dive into their question and explore how to make this work. Welcome back to another technical video. Today I'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution that you're looking for. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you work through that resolution. Let's continue on. To play audio from an S3 URL using React Native Sound, we first need to ensure that our audio files are correctly uploaded to AWS S3. Next, we will modify our code to use the S3 URL instead of a local file. This means we will replace the local file reference with the URL pointing to the audio file in S3. Make sure to handle any errors that may occur when loading the audio file. This will help you debug if the audio does not play as expected. Finally, you can play the audio by calling the play method on the sound instance. You can also add controls to pause or stop the audio. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To play audio from an S3 URL in React Native, you can use the React Native Sound Library. First, import sound from the library. Then, create a new sound instance with your audio URL. Handle any loading errors, and once the sound is loaded, simply call the play method. I hope that video helped find the resolution that you're looking for. And if it did, please, I'd appreciate it if you could hit subscribe. Until the next time that you need more technical help, I hope you have a great one. See ya.